Hey, I'm Michael. I used to share my knowledge of musical gear solution, which are cheaper and better in my opinion. But uh, due to some issues of my life, I have to make this update video and uh, tell you what happened to me. In short, I decided to leave. I'm really thankful for everyone who came to me and my channel along the way. It's been a precious memory and a unique experience for me. And I couldn't thank you more for all of these. I appreciate everyone's love and also hate because that makes me feel alive socially. But I have to say that you might will never see me make another video here because me and my wife, we decided to move our new apartment. Gotcha! But before leaving, let me show you how messed up of the back of the scene of this stupid YouTube channel. And also how messed up of my geared life. So now we are on the action camera and uh, let me show you around. Firstly, the background you guys always see, like most of my videos, the background. And then my desktop is here. I mean the desk, you can see the, this is the chair. And I always use this corner to be the, the front, like something in my frame to make it look more like a cinematic, <laughs> cinematic, oh my God. And, and there, this is the little table. And I use it to shoot the like top-down videos with my uh, light stand. And uh, now let me show you the the real dark side of the moon. You better prepare yourself because you're entering my warehouse. Okay, are you ready? This is the dark side of the moon of a gear-based YouTuber. Look at all of these masks. I, I think I'm not the only one that I keep all of my cases, of all the gears, each and every gear. They all have their own like a graveyard. There are two Voca samples, yeah, the first gen and the second gen. I just got a lot of gears and most of them I just open it and then put it back like put it there for years and uh, you can see those are the nano Korg nano series I got all of those like models like all three uh, models but with two colors two set of colors <laughs> I'm just that stupid, okay? I got two colors, not because I need to, because they they just look different. And uh, yeah, can you handle this? No, I don't think. <laughs> you don't deserve this. Let me suffer this. And uh, here is oh okay here is the Voca modular. I just pack it up. No, I never use it actually. I don't enjoy the modular like workflow. It's so messed up. SP four hundred four. And uh, this is the Mark two. I I don't know which one is Mark two, but one A model A and one Mark Mark two. Yeah, some lenses. Yeah. OP1, oh, okay. OP1 got a new Tom. This is the OP1. I won't use it. I see dust here. And, yeah, some machine. And uh, some pedals. Yeah, this is only one of my pedals. 
I got a lot. Oh yeah, those are the like uh, gaming devices, consoles, right? The Wii U. I got two Wii U's. That one is white. That one is black. All kinds of handhelds and all the masses, keyboards, controllers, Jesus, and a few books. The good thing is I don't buy a lot of books like physically. It's just so messed up. By the way, I sold quite a few gears during this day of packing and also got hundreds and hundreds of dollars back and it feels really good oh yeah another ukulele and those are two ukuleles two more new ukuleles oh there's also bags of controllers n64 controllers and uh, ngc gamecube controllers jesus i'm just so obsessed with the buttons, the knobs, stuff. I'm obsessed with gears. So you can see my channel, the current content is totally opposite as you just saw here. Because the gas therapy is in, was initially made for myself. I need a way to cure all of this disease, the gas. <gasps> My life is just messed up. I put a lot of money and time into those gears. Although I don't use those gears that much, but before I buy them, I watch a lot of tutorials, workarounds, and um, beats and music made with those gears. So that definitely cost me a lot of time. I mean, way more time than the time I'm using, I'm actually using those gears. <laughs> and I believe I'm not alone, okay? I know that I'm not alone. We are so messed up. <laughs> and uh, look at these, these smartphones, Blackberry Q10, and something else. Jesus, those keyboards, 25 key MIDI keyboards. A lot of them are still in their package, in their boxes. Jesus, see that keyboard? I almost never use that. And this is the electric, like, I mean, the uh, Hawaii, ka, ka, Kawaii piano, electric piano. The keys are actually mechanical ones, but it's actually uh, an electric. I just use, utilize the uh, mechanical keys to practice my fingers. You see, all the gears, they all have their, uh, their reason for existing here. But they are all in my imagination. They are not actually being used. The gears used most frequently in this room might be the Kawaii electric piano because I practice it sometimes. So, you know my decision. And uh, I think I also know my decision too. All right, I think you had it enough. <laughs> you don't need to suffer with all of these. And uh, please enjoy your life. So this is the sneak peek of my past few years life. And I also want to utilize this moving opportunity to clear out most of my untouched gears and then start an easier life. And also dedicated more time on instrument playing, especially for the finger drumming tutorials I'm currently working on. And I truly believe that you don't need to buy an actual drum set to be an actual drummer. All you need is just a 25 key MIDI keyboard. And I'm getting deeper and deeper on building this skill, which I'm currently sharing on my Patreon with multiple updates weekly. You can get all of my experiences and my training materials. You only need a 25 key MIDI keyboard. Any brand will do. Go check it out if you're interested. And also don't forget to grab my free plugins, AE Sample Player and Anyamp IR. 
they will definitely make your production workflow a lot easier. And uh, you can tip however you want, but they are free. So that's it, another clip it video from me. But uh, the last one here. <laughs>